Are you trying to achieve your goals, but every time you give up, you're stuck, you really don't know? Well, in this video, we're talking about a new strategy that helps you to achieve your goals in 2022. Hey, it's Roman Mahaman with our complete brand new video where we share content for everyone, every week. If you're new here, make sure you click that subscribe button and all the links to everything we mentioned, you can find them linked in the description box below. Let's jump into it. Time and effort aren't gonna guarantee you success. That's why you see a lot of people, they're patient, they're consistent with their goals, but at the end, they don't see any results. This is because they don't have the right strategy. So in this video, we're just recommending you a strategy which helped most of successful people to achieve their goals. And you can do it too in 2022. Yes! SMART is an acronym that stands for Specific, Measurable, Actionable, Relevant, and Time-Bound. Goals that are specific have a significantly greater chance of being accomplished. In order to make a goal specific, you need to ask these five questions. Number one, what? What do I want to achieve? Number two, who? Who's involved in this goal? Number three, where? Where is this goal to be achieved? When do I want to do that? And why do I want to achieve this goal? These are all five questions that you need to ask yourself if you want to make your goal specific. For example, a general goal would be to get in shape, but a more specific goal would be, I want to obtain a gym membership at my local community center, and I want to work out for four days in order to be healthier. A SMART goal must have a criteria in order to measure your progress. If there is no criteria, you will not be able to determine your progress. So in order to make a goal measurable, you need to ask how much, how many, how do you know you reach your goal and what is your indicator in order to measure your progress. For example, you decided to obtain a gym membership at your local community center and work out for four days in order to be healthier. Your aim is to lose one pound in each week. A SMART goal should be achievable and actionable. This will help you understand what is your goal and you can find many ways in order to work towards it. The achievability of your goal should be stretched in order to make you feel challenged. In order to make your goals achievable, you need to ask this question. Do you have the resources and capabilities in order to achieve these goals? If no, what are you missing? Have others done it successfully before? A SMART goal should be achievable, I said before, but a SMART goal should be realistic. You need to be realistic about your goal. Do you really believe that you can achieve this goal with the given available resources and time? You need to ask yourself that do you really uh, commit achieving this goal? Your goal needs to have a start date and a finish date. A SMART goal should be time bound. If there is no time constraint, there is no sense of urgency and less motivation you will put in order to achieve that goal. For example, you decided that on August 1st, I will obtain gym membership at my local community center and I will work out for four days in a week and I will aim to lose one pound in each week. At the end of August month, I will lose four pounds, which makes it a SMART goal. A SMART goal sets you up for success by making goal specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. And this method helps you push you further, gives you a sense of direction, organize, and reach your goal.